he's going to start Ken. Unless we see Jump Steady go up 2-0, then we could see Terry come out. But, I mean, I want to see Terry. Let's be real. I want to see Terry. <laughs> yeah, we love Terry. Terry, boys. Terry's hype, bro. <laughs> I mean, it's hype watching. I don't like getting, like, jabbed like getting... a million times. <laughs> and, like, auto turn around and then, like, random power gazer catch my jump. Dead at, like, 100. Dude, Terry is so hyped, though. Like, he What's yells out all his moves. <laughs> How okay, though? Are you okay? All right, but I think about this matchup, and it seems really damn hard for Ken. I think Palu can space at that range, like, that's really annoying for Ken to deal with. Focus just gets ate up by aerials, like, up air and air. Look, look, you see the way that jump's facing most of the time. He's facing, like, max back air distance. Yeah. And that's hard for Ken to whip punish most of the time. But look at the positioning that Naito's taking. He's... He's dashing in. He's using the quick dash that Ken you can uh, has in his disposal, and uh, staying within a certain distance so that if Jump Steady pushes the button and does whiff, he's going to be able to run in and pressure. Yeah, but that's like the opposite playstyle usually for Nilo. I mean, it's working for him now because he has so much reward when he does hit Kalu. I, I would love to see how this, how as the set goes on, how Nilo's going to adapt to like this matchup right now. I'm telling you, Edge guarding is also very easy. I feel the answer is Terry. <laughs> Okay, good recovery using the Rising Tatsu. Oh, why has no one blocked that, bro? I don't know, man. It's the same even, thing with, even like, me, K-Rule. Even me, I'm no one. <laughs> <laughs> I get hit by that, too. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, this is standing scary. Jab, Look, standing he's just jab. standing there. Standing there. Menacingly. It's so scary, though. Cause, oh, we, wow, did he go through, like, the gap of the auto reticle and back air? Yes, he did. What a brain. I mean, man. that's that's the the downfall of auto reticle, though. It just takes, it shoots. It'll never change the angle that it takes a shot at. So if you're rising as it shoots at you, it's just going to completely whip. And it actually has a lot of lag, so you can challenge the you can challenge the move fairly easily. Yeah, it's like the same thing with Joker's uh, side B as well. It has like that one angle that's really like easy to get under, and it has a little bit of any lag, so you can punch his work. But right now, Jump Steady looking really nice. I love the empty hops in neutral. That's really going to be a good way for him to bait out these options from Nito. That's true. Oh. Okay, tattooing the other way, creating a lot of pressure. And look at the look at that Street Fighter two coming. You see that down tilt into Hadouken. Yeah, I love that. Oh, oh damn! Can't do that in Street Fighter. Is that combo in this game? Weak down air, down, down air. Yeah. Oh, dude, that's disgusting. Damn. It, like that looks so good for Jump Steady. And then Nino's like, actually, I'm gonna put you in the corner, and then I'm gonna kill you. I mean, down air in the corner has always been something that, you know, Ryu and Smash Four, and then of course the Shotos have here in this game. Oh, nice! He knew he was gonna roll. roll. All right, what's he gonna do to get back to the ledge here? Snipe? This should be a wow. Yeah, that's, that's a good that's jump. It. All right, damn. I was Stop the momentum it. because I think he was trying to use Rising Tatsu to really close the gap between right. himself and the ledge. Right, right, right. We'll take it all day. Here comes the Nair train. Have fun. Oh, yeah, easy free 56, 56 Free 56. He held shield, and then he dropped shield. <laughs> <laughs> he did the right thing. Oh, that down tilt, though. Yeah, okay. you already know you're getting caught by that. Yeah, Peace to. out. That was a beautiful edge guard. That's, that's exactly what you're supposed to do. That's the worst part about, like, you know, trying to recover as can. You're going to be susceptible to, like, getting edge guard very easily. Even if he did, like, light Tatsu, which is, like, the shortest Tatsu that Ken has, it still would have been... It, uh, laggy enough for him to get hit by that back air. Yeah. Oh. That's the name of the game. Oh. 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 King of Fighters Stadium. Wait, wait. Oh, he didn't pick a good. Well, this song's all right, but yeah, song's all I don't right. like this one. Wait, does this mean you're picking Terry? No. Oh. No. Come on. You can't pick the King of Fighters stage and not pick Terry, bro. You might as well pick the, like, the Street Fighter stage. Nah, Terry. Why don't people King of Fighters has better music, man. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I'm not even going <laughs> to argue that. I'm not even going to argue. Even Sakurai thinks so. That's why he put so much. Songs in the game. 50 songs. <laughs> yeah. All right, we're on Battlefield, which is, I I honestly don't think this, this stage is bad for Palo at all. Probably one of our best stages, honestly. Yeah, especially with being having the multi-hit of the neutral air. Okay, catch the second jump. But he doesn't just have the stage power-up. He has the music power-up. Let's see if it leads to a 1-1 situation here. I mean, he's got the fighters in the background gassing him up. Look at that guy. Throwing like, punches. yo, you're not in our game. He's shadow boxing in the background. <laughs> you're not in our game, but we still we still like you. <laughs> you, you. You don't wear shoes like us. <laughs> I think only some of them wear shoes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Down throw, back air, okay. That's, we actually, I think that we haven't seen a lot of focus attacks coming out from Nito. It's so, I don't know, I feel like it's so hard to make that move work because he has, once he sees you start committing a focus, he can nair and uh, up air you, but finally we get a sure you can kill from Nito there. Sometimes a very inconsistent move. Like you just fall out of the shuriken sometimes. Yeah, it'd be like that sometimes. Okay, Ooh, wait, hold up, the pressure. He's rocking up too much percent right now. And he has him at the ledge where he wants him. I like the tattoo I did, because if he teleported badly, it would have hit him in the gap between the recovery at the ledge. Okay, you think he would have gotten oh. a stage spike? Or, yeah, stage bounce, stage spike? Yeah. I think Kalu has like, you have four frames to hit her out of her. That's right. Piece. I think all the teleports have that. So. Oh, I'll turn around to the rescue. <laughs> Sometimes you just got to <laughs> let the game play for you. That is some of the best advice I've received when it comes oh. to those characters. Dude, that's so funny because Jump State would have got a free grabber any, versus any other character, but like, Ken <laughs> automatically turned around. He's like, oh, thanks. I'm, I'm winning this situation now. <laughs> oh, did you think you mixed me up? Nope. <laughs> Actually. <laughs> oh, okay. Where are you going, Jump Steady? Teleporting to the center stage. We have a Ken with max right, rage. My man really just tried to reverse short you him. He's like, I don't even have anything to lose. I got three stocks. I don't care at all. Three stocks, max rage. Trying to put on a little bit more damage before oh, that stock drops. up, bro. Nito's stacking it up, dude. And Jump Steady's panic air dodges, bro? They're getting called out. Okay, but this is the Jump Steady time. Oh, get off of me. The short you can time. Dang, the power up was real. You know Come what that means, though? Like, you know what that means, Strides? We're playing on this stage again? Like, we're never going to see Terry. Yeah, we're not seeing we're Terry. We're not seeing Terry. Terry's staying on the bench. <laughs> I really would love to see Terry, though. Just, just for the hype. But I feel like Terry gets bodied by Palu way worse. I think about the edge guard versus Palu. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, Terry can mix up his re recovery with, like, burn knuckle, crack shoot. Install with uh, the power wave. But... None of that you're matters right. versus Nair. You're, you're right. Literally none of that you're matters right. versus Nair or, or uh, Explosive Flame. You're right. Or Auto Reticle. Yeah. Sad days. Get swap out of here, man. <laughs> 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 Alright, let's see what happens on everyone's favorite stage. Pokemon Stadium 2. Or PlayStation 2, as some like to call it. Wow, some people actually call it that? Oh, no, I heard Kony say it once. Oh. You know, if Kony says it, oh, it's alright. Right. All the commentators are saying it. <laughs> Anyway, let's see the adaptation here from Jump Steady. Because that was a really strong game one from Jump Steady, but I feel like Nito, he got in way more. And then once he noticed that Jump was just panic, like air dodging and like rolling, he just didn't let him play. Ooh, up air, canceled into oh. a true short Yukin. Landing with the falling back air. Now what's the ledge up going to be? Oh, very smart. Who needs a neutral get up when you can come out swinging? Yeah, you have some invincibility on that too, so you can get through that ledge trap with a down tilt. Oh my god, max range on that move. Okay, okay. Down tech throw. chase. Yeah, big up there. And we're getting, he's not going to focus in that situation because the up air in there is going to hit for free. That's very true, but I'm just thinking like, even just using focus to mix up the, the momentum, the direction that you're falling, could be a good tool that, you know, Ken has. You mean, oh, 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 whoa. Oh, we're playing third strike? Yeah, Where's Justin Wong at? I didn't see him. <laughs> <laughs> this is a very important first stock, and they both know it. You can tell we're facing the neutral right now. Yeah, and I think that's another reason why uh, we saw Nito go to Battlefield wow. versus a large stage like this. It's less room for Jump Steady to pull back if he, in fact, wants to stall out. That's very true. Well, there's a focus. Getting hit by Nair. Yep. Drift the dream. We're never going to see that move again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, falling Nair. We see another one. A couple of Nairs actually connecting due to that trade. Oh, 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 beautiful combo. My guy is out of here. What the heck was that, bro? That was clean. Nairs into down air. I don't know. I think New York Plunge game is some of the best I've seen in a while. And that's really scary if your name's Jump Steady because it's Ken. <laughs> Ken with good fun <laughs> game means you don't get to live very long. This man's wild. He just runs at you swinging, kicking. Look at him, dude. How many people run at you kicking? Not that many, actually. <laughs> yeah, we got that free cross up. You're not going to shield grab this move at all. And I really think that Nino is moving really well right here. He's starting to use the focus now, too. He feels safe using that as a movement option. 
Okay, I think the more, in and out yeah, the more Nito looks comfortable, the, the more I feel scared for Jump Steady. Look how I'm swinging all these safe moves. Oh! Okay, he had to drop shield there. <laughs> I, I, I think he just got shield poked, honestly. Well, that worked out for yeah, Jump Steady because that would have broke. And he would have died because he's at the ledge. All right, oh Tatsu trying to go for the chase, but oh. using his jump only for another Tatsu to hit. Jump Steady to the oh. ledge. He's chasing him down, too. Yeah, but Jump Steady, you know, he's looking for that one hit. He's really just like one good fair or back air. Okay, down throw. We're going to see the nice. focus. No focus coming from Nito, and that's going to even up the no, stocks. No DI either. Uh, he might even DI'd in on that down throw. Uh, let's see the comeback from. Oh! oh! And, and he, he pushes, pushes him. him off. Exactly what you're supposed to do when you get that shield break. Just push him off the stage. Damn, he, he definitely got shield poked the first time there. Yeah, he did. Because he was still like holding shield in that situation. <laughs> Yo, Nito, with the adaptation. The first game was so good for Jump Steady. What's going on? Well, Ken is coming back out, but we could see a possible character change from Jump Steady. Are we going to see the Zero Suit Samus, or is he going to stick it out with Polytech? Honestly, I, I want to see Zero Suit. You really? Yeah. I think Paul is amazing in this matchup. I, I honestly don't even think it's a character right now. I think Nito is just trying to have Jump Stage number. Like, he has his habits kind of tuned, fine tuned right now. I think it's going to be up to Jump State to really, like, adapt to how uh, Neo's playing right now. Because he has all the tools to do well. He has great aerials, great moves of space, great edge guarding capabilities, a grab game. All these things are really good versus Ken. But, I don't know, maybe Jump State just has to oh, 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 that's right. very yeah, yeah. Maybe Jump State just has to do that, you know, just yep. force an SD there. <laughs> I mean, what's the fact that... Jump State was pressuring Nito, especially very low compared to the stage. Uh, and was forced to use the focus attack to cancel it. Oh, dropping there confirms that low percent. You don't want to see that as a palu. But it's fine. Well, he is at kill percent, but he's still playing really well. He's not giving Nito like free options. Nice. Yeah, but he's also up a whole stock, so yeah. you know, just to roll the dice a little bit, play a little bit more dangerously. Uh, it's pretty acceptable. Okay, he's gonna land. That Tatsu was like the very last sliver of hitbox. Oh yeah, get out of there, bro. Don't get still broken again. Yeah, you you can even see Jump Steady expend the second jump, the double jump to just make sure he's completely out of there. No danger zone for him. Beautiful but trade. The trade. And now we have three one I for Jump Steady. Palu is still the answer here. All right, he, he got killed, but he's he's still playing real. This is exactly what Jump City wants. Oh, yeah, directional air dodge, not getting punished, but another Tatsu, that's gonna get punished. Forward throw into auto reticle. Yeah, get all the free percent from the projectiles. Oh, no second jump from Jump City. Okay, looks like he realized it and still opted to recover low. Yeah, Jump's playing very safe now. This is exactly what you wanna do in this situation. Oh! Oh, wow, okay. falling out. <laughs> Sometimes that sure you can just doesn't work the way you want it to. But oh, okay, make sure that sure you can the correct direction, jumping from the ledge back air connects. Now the ledge pressure is coming out from Nito. Nice teleport edge cancel there from Jump Steady. He's really milking this stock for all it's worth. Dude, Nito is fishing for that up air too. He wants to just cancel into the sure you can, but just a couple too many down tilts, and that's gonna push Jump Steady just far enough out. Yeah. Back throw here. Back throw. Explosive flame, auto reticle. Whatever you want. <laughs> he could have just gone off there and nared him if he was feeling brave enough. Oh, opportunity here. <laughs> All right. If he was feeling brave enough, he would have went off and thrown the wall out. <laughs> just try and push push uh, Nito back a little bit. But the back air does connect. 134%. Not quite at max rage yet, but I think we see Jump Steady reach about 60%. Then he could be in danger, but the nair is going to poke. Yeah, he just threw the nair out. He's like, all right, deal with this move. If, if it hits your shield, it's probably safe anyway. Like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, even if Nito had, you know, was able to get the reverse nair into down air, being at 0%, Jump said he still would have made it back. Yeah. Risk reward was in his favor for sure. Another game five. You guys are so good in top eight. They're all, well, so far, they've all been really close to the show. So this is going to go down to the last one here. Let's see. We're not seeing the Terry. We're not seeing the Zero Suit. Man, Palu Ken the whole way. 
<laughs> Both these guys have had a pretty long losers run too, I think. You would hate to see it end here, but it can be only one. We're back on Pokemon Stadium too, which I'm a little bit surprised about. Considering there's no DSR, I guess Jump City banned Battlefield after losing on that stage. That's what a smart person would do, I guess. That's true. Okay, Ooh. getting the getting the reset from the Tatsu, able to extend into just a little bit more damage, 44% onto Jump City. Oh, I love these dash back. Uh, I don't know if that's his F tilt or F yeah. jab. Okay, jab. Standing jab. Yeah, I like the range on that move. And it has a decent, like, above hitbox to catch jump. I'll let's see if he use that move a little bit more. Oh! Uh, now, Jump State is just dropping shield immediately in that situation. He's like, I'll just take the hit. I don't even want to get deal with shield break. Right now, Nido's facing really damn well. Sure. Oh, look, look, look at this corner pressure. Yeah, he's not letting him leave the corner, dude. Finally gets out of there. It's a nerf for his troubles, too. Yeah, ends it with the upper. Where's he going to land? Oh, wow, the Tatsu beat out his hitbox. This should be a punish? No, too far. Yeah, I was just looking for the parry into the roll, maybe. Yeah. Trying to get behind Jump City for a punish, but Jump City ending the uh, ending the rapid jab at the correct moment. That shield was an Eminem. Oh, Cowderman shield a little bit too long. Okay, right. couple projectiles coming out. Wow. Explosive flame gonna cover the recovery from Jump City. Oh, but his jump got caught. Oh my. He got the grazing hit on that. That's so unlucky for Nito, and he oh. dies for it. You hate to see it, but he'll die very soon right now. Tech chase? No. Yeah, especially after such a good start that Nito had. Yeah. But Jump Steady just you know, sticking to those fundamentals, sticking to those Nair trains, racking up all the damage onto Nito. Oh, but there is the back air. Finds it, Mark. And only 32% here, but Jump Steady catching him in shield, getting all the pressure with the throw combos. Wow, explosive flame, explosive flame. auto radical, <laughs> free up air. He threw everything at him. Almost every special thrown at Neo here. He's at such a high percent. Jump say is playing so patiently too, getting all the free hits he can. Wow, the animation for the Dukens made Ken stick his hands out far enough for the explosive flame to connect. Kind of unfortunate for Nito, but it doesn't look like he got punished too hard for it. Yeah, now Nito, man, he finds himself in a position where he's forced to approach versus Palu. It, you never want to be in that situation because he has all the moves to it punish you and Ken's range isn't that great. But he has rage on his side though. He has rage on his side and he has a really good ledge trapping game that he's been utilizing this entire set. Wait a minute. Oh! oh. Wait a minute. Don't sleep on rage, Ken. Oh! No! Oh and a missed my. input from Jump City. That's the worst time Are in you? game five. Are you kidding me? Oh man. You really hate to see it, but if it's if it's jump state, I think you can take this stock without losing any percent. Oh man, the crowd's going crazy behind us. They are actually here cheering for both players. You see Nito over here, near all here, jump steady, and there connects. It's supposed to flame. Ooh. Yeah, you respect CLB at the ledge. Oh my goodness, so much pressure from the aerials. Neo's just trying to find that one tiny opening. There it is. The dash attack's not safe on shield. And he got him in the corner. Don't block. Okay, oh, okay. my God. Why would you still hold shield there? Maybe if I was in shield stun. Maybe. You would think, right? Well, I think oh. he dashed back a little bit just so that he wouldn't get the all the shield pressure. Interesting. Okay. Finally. Back air connects. Only, only taking 30%. Yeah, only 30. That's not too bad. He can actually get 56 if he gets the right nair. But, oh, my God. Nito's applying too much pressure right now. Through another up air. Back at the leg. Surprised that Nito oh. didn't, uh, didn't, he's not canceling his up airs. He must be waiting until uh, Jump Steady's at a little bit higher to convert into, or cancel into the Goryuken. Uh, Love the platform extension there from Jump Steady, getting the 50%, but he's gonna do a little bit more. That kill percent here. Oh, there's the up air. Not gonna focus on my watch. Oh! Directional air there. Okay. Right to the platform, sure, you can. though. It's safe. Oh my goodness, what a parry. And now, I feel like Neo can sneeze on him at this point. Oh, 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 oh. yeah, you have to escape. That almost feel like a bait for oh. for, uh, for Jump Steady to oh roll, my. but Jump Steady not opting for it. Oh my God, this is such a scary situation for both players, but mainly Jump Steady. Look, he's just swinging all these safe moves. Nito just F smashed in neutral. Oh, they're crazy. <laughs> oh, he's at the ledge once again. The explosive flame gets caught by the Hodokin. What's he gonna do? He's got the ledge. Oh, pressure. He just backs off. <laughs> One up tilt, oh. one up tilt, and then retreating. Okay, a couple down tilt. Dash tag gonna connect. We're gonna see some of the, someone's numbers raise a little bit. So rough. Oh, the back air crossed up. 
It was safe. Nito continues to look for that back roll. Yeah, from center stage. The patience plays off, and you gotta, you gotta wonder how that set would have played out.